And now Israel's navy fired warning shots this weekend at some 20 Palestinian fishing boats sailing towards Israel from Gaza City. According to Israel's military spokesperson, the boats intended to challenge Israel's naval blockade of the coastal enclave, heading towards the maritime border before the navy gave verbal warnings, followed by firing into the air. Witnesses on board said some tried to set tires on fire and float them towards the border before being confronted by four Israeli naval vessels. Yesterday's flotilla was part of the March of Return protests, which have seen tens of thousands of Gazans march violently along the border fence with Israel every Friday over the past few months. But unlike the March of Return, which seeks to gain a right of return for Palestinians to immigrate to Israel, Organizers of the flotilla say that the effort was aimed at showing the importance of lifting the Israeli and Egyptian blockade around the Strip. This is also demand outlined in a potential ceasefire agreement between Israel and Hamas, currently being brokered by Egypt. No ceasefire has yet been publicly agreed upon, however, and both Israel and Egypt have maintained the blockade around Gaza to keep weapons and related materials away from the terror group Hamas, which controls the Strip.